Hello friends, this is Bidhan. Welcome you to my channel. Today we will see a problem from June 2015 booklet code C, question number 51, 61. Question number is 61. In the circuit given below, the thermistor has a resistance 3 k ohm at 25 degrees Celsius. Its resistance decreases by 150 ohm per degree Celsius upon heating. The output voltage of the circuit at 30 degrees Celsius is this is clearly inverter circuit with feedback why inverter because the input voltage is going to negative terminal and positive terminal is grounded and why feedback because we can see there is a circuit going from output to the input we need to find the output but at 30 degrees celsius not at 25 degrees celsius This is the resistance R1 which is before the operational amplifier and here we have the resistance RF called the feedback resistance. Now for this problem our feedback resistance is actually the resistance of this thermistor. And what happens with the resistance of thermistor is that the resistance can change with temperature. It is temperature sensitive. And when you increase the temperature then the resistance decreases and when you decrease the temperature resistance increases so this is the reverse process with temperature and why this happens because thermistor has a property their property is called negative temperature coefficient of resistivity and actually this is the property of semiconductor in semiconductor when you increase the temperature resistance decreases and when you decrease the temperature resistance increases and since our thermistor is actually a semiconductor device and that is why it also have negative temperature coefficient of resistivity whereas for our normal conductors like iron and copper we have positive temperature coefficient of resistivity that means when you increase the temperature the resistance also increases and when you decrease the temperature resistance decreases but here the case is opposite to that they have negative temperature coefficient resistivity that means if you increase the temperature resistance decreases and we can see this from here that at 25 degrees celsius the resistance of thermistor is 3k ohm but when we take this circuit to 30 degrees celsius then its resistance decreases and what is the rate of decrease it decreases by 150 ohm per degree celsius increase in temperature so let us see here is our circuit and RF the feedback resistance which is actually the resistance of the thermistor in this case at 25 degrees Celsius is equal to 3 kilo ohm as given in the problem that means 3000 ohm now since we have to find out the output at 30 degrees Celsius so first of all we will find out the resistance here at 30 degrees Celsius that means we will found, find RF at 30 degrees Celsius now we have to use the condition in our problem in our problem it says that given that per degree Celsius temperature increase RF decreases by decreases by 150 ohm as given here that per degree Celsius increase that means heating it decreases 150 by it decreases by 150 ohm now the circuit is going from 25 degree Celsius to 30 degree Celsius that means how much increase in temperature 5 degree so for 5 degree temperature increase how much is the decrease in the feedback resistance that is what we have to find that means for 5 degree celsius temperature increase RF decreases by how much it will decrease by 150 times 5 ohm that means 750 ohm so here it will become 3000 minus 750 ohm 
and this is equal to 2250 ohm that means this resistance at 25 degree it was 3000 ohm but when I change the temperature to 30 degree it became 2250 ohm by a reduction of 750 ohm now we can easily find out our output since we have already understood that this is the inverter circuit with feedback so what is the output for inverter circuit with the feedback this is minus RF by R1 into V input now what is the feedback resistance this is now 2250 because we want the output at 30 degrees Celsius by R1 is already there 1k V input this is minus 1 volt now minus minus become plus the zero and zero cancel this equals 2.25 that means output is 2.25 volt so we have got it now in our problem it says that there are two similar outputs minus 2.25 and 2.25 but we have plus 2.25 so the answer is 3 thank you